best above all the rest, put me to the test. Yeah. Expect nothing less, you check as I'm chess, what's happening next? Yeah. He got the venom, a tangible weapon, no coming in second. This life is a lesson. He got a new engine from pain, it's a blessing. New focus, no guessing, just bold an obsession. All in his possession, you got the retention. I leave an impression and take a redemption. Just kill no discretion, your mind is a. Hey guys, welcome back to the C and J show. And I have my favorite Jenny Juice here, and I got my sister Nick. And we hope that you guys are having a good day today. And today's topic is going to be, it's its a sad topic. Um, so we know that Tracy, I'm, yeah, Tracy Braxton mm -hmm. passed. And our condolences goes out to the family and her friends and stuff like that. And I'm pretty sure everybody, majority of anybody that watched the Braxtons, you... It's like they became your family inside right. of your home. Mm -hmm. Now we're gonna switch it for for one second, just for a second. We're just gonna switch it up a little bit. Um, so you guys wanna bow? See, y'all didn't even know I was gonna do this, did it? Y'all mm -hmm. wanna bow your heads really quick? Mm -hmm. Let's bow our heads, okay, and close our eyes, cause this is serious. Um, God, we understand the situation in the matter right now, and if the shoe fit. Somebody got to wear it. If it does not, if it don't fit you, then don't don't let it be no bother. But, yes, I'm going to get on a lot of you women because today's topic is about you. And I'm not going to stop at all. Amen. Amen. Let's raise our heads up. Amen. Okay, so can I say something first? Yes. Can, I'm just going to say a little bit of something first. Okay, so now when I seen this picture right here, I seen this, I seen this picture. And I think you would have to be, you would just have to be ignorant and you would have to be blind not to realize that, okay, it's one thing with like losing weight, but but if you were a certain age, I think you do know what if somebody looks sick, right? right? So in her face area, she looked at kind of, she looks sick, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. But what I want y'all to, I want y'all to tell me why this lady have to. Post this picture. Turn the comments off. Because it got so it got so brutal with, with the comments of what everybody was saying. Now now why she had to do that? Please tell me. People are ignorant though. You know? And that's I mean that's what happened with Chad Ballswick. That's what happened with to a lot of people that were, you know, just suffering in silence and stuff like that. Or not so much suffering in silence, but want that illness or whatever to be left, you know, just like private and with their families and friends and stuff. And he came out from being, you know, Black Panther, muscle bound dude or whatever, to being like a hundred and, you know, yeah, very yeah, small, yeah. you know. And people just drug them, like, you know what I mean? Yeah. You know? So, yeah, I mean, I don't know why people do that. Kiki, but why you had to put out a, a thing even much about her baby? Yeah. Today. Yeah. Oh, really? What happened? Well, her baby has... Um, it's, it's trisomy 13. Basically, you have three chromosomes when you're supposed to have two. Mm -hmm. So it, it's basically like a, a birth defect, I guess, for the, for the baby. And she was crying and saying, you know, all of the hateful comments and things like that, that, you know. Yeah, but you know what really gets to me though, because I, I know I had, because I want because I know people gonna be like, well, dang, they said they, they they had prayed. What the prayer? What was the prayer about? When they gonna get to it? I'm gonna get to it. I, I, sometimes I'm just trying to go slow before I go real fast, y'all. But I guess let me just get on into it right now. Now, see, the thing is with me. You remember when we was talking? We were having that conversation about Snoop Dogg's daughter mm -hmm. and the things that was going on with her, and we went down the list, and you said me that. But wait, majority of those comments come from women. Mm -hmm. Now you yeah. see, majority of the comments for everything come from low life, not having gangster fingers, women that you would, you, to me personally, you would think that we kind of would stay in touch in tune with ourselves to be able to feel another woman's pain because mm -hmm. instead of just pretending like, oh, it don't happen to you, like for an example, um, Tasha K and Angela Easy, they, they may say some stuff in a way, but then you act like your man ain't never cheat. Right. Knowing like, okay, so I'm going to just drag this person to the filth and then leave it be. It ain't going to mm -hmm. say that. Mm -hmm. Then we go on to Tiny. Oh, yeah, she Miss Piggy. This girl daughter had to come back and say, no, my mom is beautiful. Like, I love my mom. 
But mm -hmm. these are women. These ain't men saying like, oh, God dang, Tony, you look like it. Mm -hmm. These are women and it's like, why do we continue to do this? Now, this is the part. This is the part here. Now, when I look into, and I looked at that picture with uh, Tracy in her face, you know what I, you know what I seen in that picture? Now, see, this is what really pissed me off with these um, wannabe chicks. I can't stand them. I, I never stood for them. And almost, I just really can't even do it. But what I seen was a woman that probably went on a day that she got the strength. You mm -hmm. know, like when you're sick, I don't care what kind of sickness it is. But we know different sicknesses like this. Is, is different, but if you are sick and you've been sick for a while, just to get yourself up, mm -hmm. when you find yourself having a little bit of strength, you want to get up and probably, you know, she's thinking too, losing that weight drastically like that and things is going on. I'm pretty sure that the, the doctors didn't tell her, you probably got X, Y, and Z amount of time to live. Mm -hmm. You take a picture just for dumb women to sit up here and pretend as if they ain't got no mama or no grandma. You ain't got no kids. You mm -hmm. ain't got nobody. So you do that. So see, mm -hmm. when I look at the picture, I look at it for a woman that's saying, listen, I got to do this because I want to, you know, this may be my last day that I got to see my son, my husband, my grand, my grandchild, his wife and family. I'm going through something, you know, and this is what I get. Mm, yeah, but see, I think they already know and knew. Um, you know, I, 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 even though it, I mean it's not a good thing, and I never, you know, I think people. Well, go who you it, said knew? I'm saying like the, you know, like the Braxton celebrities, yeah, they different knew. people. I feel like they know what's to come from people, and I feel like um, I think they'd be prepared a lot of the time. Sad to say, to. Um, um, you know, like a lot of times, like they, they know, like, okay, well, you know, let me just turn the comments off or whatever it is, because I know how people can be, you know, people are heartless or whatever. And I think a lot of the times it's not grown women. It's a lot of trolls, a lot of young kids, a lot of, you know, young girls online and just seeing the first thing to come to their mind, you know, hoping that they come and get, you know, notice or something for whatever the reason, hopefully that somebody, one of the celebrities will respond to them. Yeah. So I don't. I mean, but I like, how you gonna hold woman. that for someone being sick though? But that's the thing. Nobody, knew. nobody don't know. But that's the thing too that I I don't agree with, and I feel like, but you know what? I can't even say that I don't agree with it because your your health is your own. You can you know decide whether you want to publicize Share. you know your mm -hmm. health and stuff like that. But I just feel like for other people suffering with the same stuff, I think it would shed so much light you know, on it. So much people ignore their health issues. So much people, you know, ignore these things when you, you know, you, oh, maybe it's just this or maybe it's just that. Right. You got a bigger platform. But, you know, if you hear this coming from somebody, you know, that has millions and millions of followers, you know, you could, you could, you can reach so much people from, you know, just telling your story. But then again, it is their story. It's personal to them. So, you know, it's a personal choice. But I personally feel like, bringing more awareness to these things yeah. would do better. Right. Because I feel like that, cause that's, it is true because I think a lot of people have been suffering just privately. Like Even much with Virgil just yeah, died. Virgil, Chad, you know, Oswick and Boswick and then, you know, her and this is like people like for years, two years, three years, whatever it is, suffer with a cancer and a lot of, you know, I forgot to get you guys name, um, Kangol, um, Enrique Smiley, Kimmel, um, Kimmel Smith. Kimmel. no, he's an old school rapper. I think it was like Kangol something. It's like basically, you know, the Kangol hats. Yeah. So it was something, um, the name was something along those lines. But basically, he went on, he was like, Look, I'm just telling you guys what to like, you know, what it was for me. Because he's like, I know us men don't like to go and get checked. And so he was saying, like, how he used the bathroom, and one of the time that he went, it was basically it was bloody, but the blood was like um, was like basically like if you was to sneeze and then there was like blood in it. You get what I mean? Like oh yeah, that, okay. that kind of consistency. And he was like um, basically I don't know, he just gave you you know what to look for because he's like you know sometimes I know we can be confused like okay well maybe you know um, I ain't going a while or whatever maybe that's what the blood might. But you know you know that's one thing too. Me that to me that's that's. 
to me personally, that's something a little bit different. Like as far as then, okay, I share with you that you're not going through something alone and look for these signs and to be this. And then it's another thing when I come on and I'm going through changes within my own self that you just don't expect, forget X, Y, and Z, right. you know how you got it. The thing is I go on, on and I'm not expecting this. And I get this, just like with K. Michelle, what did they want this girl to do because whoever she went to to, to get something done, they made her look like she went through the youth fountain for good. <laughs> what could she have done? But even that, her, she totally had to turn it off. And we're talking mm -hmm. about chicks that don't mind getting into your face and telling you, nah, I ain't gonna let that slide. Mm -hmm. She had to put it up, put it down. Um, Jocelyn had to put it away for a second. It's too much sometimes to go on here and look at these Easter dumb bunnies mm -hmm. continue. A lot of it, 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 it really it is. And they just continue to continue. And you're trying to cover, you're trying to just cover something. And it's like, well, dang, it's almost like, and it ain't nothing like this though, but it is almost like having a child with a mental illness, knowing if you put them in the front, why should I have to protect my child from grown people? Mm. And why should I have to protect my child from women? But then they get mad when people are private. You know what I mean? Oh, well, she thinks she's too good or he thinks he's too good. Like how they do Beyonce. Everything is very private. Like we get on to oh, promote yeah. our stuff. Yeah, and, and that's it. And that's it. Y'all don't y'all don't get to come inside of my life because you're not gonna affect my day to day. You get what I'm saying? And I feel like I and I'm trying to figure that. out what she do because Beyonce is the only person in the world that I know didn't fail, didn't have different things, and it happened. It's like she it just doesn't somebody must be take that that I think phone away from her. I think she's completely but I mean she only posts what she wants people to see. So I, I, yeah. I don't feel like when when it's like that, there's only so much people can say. Like you get what I'm saying? Yeah. It's like I'm doing a photo shoot, I'm looking my best, I'm feeling my best. You get what I'm saying? It's not just an at home picture that I'm gonna give to you guys. You know, you're not gonna see me at home, you're not gonna see me in my backyard. Like everything is, it is photo it shoots is. type. Yeah. Do you get what I'm saying? So. But um, you know, like we said, with that, I could go you know, it's almost like the song Hours and Hours, and that's why I think go hours and hours on this with um, these freaking chicks. I mean, I just don't get it. You know, if you can just find it within yourself, some some of the times, I know people are very cold, but Jesus, come on, give it a break, okay? Yeah, but I think that they're not going to never learn. I and think it's, it's always just, like fake pages, or yeah, people yeah, who have, you click their profile and their page is private, or you know, it's just people purposely create fake pages just to be nasty. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you and know? then you be wishing those people like that. As soon as you do stuff like that, you back up out the driveway, and then it's like an eighteen wheeler is going so fast, and then you. And then it's like, okay, you you learn then to just stop. But yeah. you know, hey, that's what that's my feeling. And like I just had said, I can go hours and hours on this with how people make people feel, and that really did bother me to know that this lady. You know, trying to do what she could do. Take this picture. I already know what's going on. Just for some dumb people to be. Oh my God, I didn't know so much. You look so sick. What she got? Da, 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 da. Like, come on, chick. You know what she got? Cause some of your people probably got it. Like, come mm -hmm. on, just stop. It, it, it makes no sense. It doesn't does it really matter? This is not Will, Wendy Williams here. Yeah. And when the Williams came, came mm -hmm. look, taking a picture, right, so right. it'd be different. Mm -hmm. But um. That's it. We ain't even gonna go because, like I just said, I was finna get ready to write a whole book it's on you people. Yeah, like it, it is. Just, it is. I feel like it even is. once they did that, we did this whole thing like, oh, we gotta do better. Look what Chad was going through, and everybody like, da da da. And as soon as somebody the else, next the, thing. the next person that's like, you know, big and whatever, who lost that weight or looked that way, the the very next thing is to to do that. Yeah. Okay, so what we're gonna do, I guess this is it, and I just yeah, hope P to the tra tra to Tracy Braxton yes. and, and the, you know yeah. those instead of family. I know it's a very tough loss. Aside from those people, it, you know it don't matter honestly what they say or whatever right yeah. now. Mm -mm. You know our family is going through, 
you know, a, a, a hardship and, you know, heartbreak. You know, they're a very close family from far, from far as I can see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, you know, my heart really goes to them. I can care less about these, about whoever it is that said anything. Yeah, and, I, and I don't. I just was just so, trying to say, like, come on, guys. Like, as see. women, we, our, our hearts are supposed to be a little, little bit more, yeah. yeah, a little bit better than that. But, guys, we're out, and I guess that's going to be it. 